Hello everyone, welcome back to Southwest Wisconsin Metal Detecting. Nice to see you again. I'm Steve. Today I had the opportunity to detect a house in my hometown. Small corner lot. It was built in the late 1800s. Had a fun day. Found some nice relics, some old coins, some silver, and some old toys. So let's get right to the hunt. My first target today ended up being a Jefferson nickel from 1975 or three, I believe. On to the next beep. I believe I've got a wheat scent out of this hole. I'll clean it off, see if I can get a date. It ended up being a 1953D wheat scent. On to the next beep. Out of this hole, I think I got a little hairpin. I'll get her brushed off, see what it looks like. Yeah, I think it was a little hair barrette. It's got the little clips on the back. Cute little cat. All right. On to the next beep. Out of this hole, I believe it's nickel sized. We'll get her cleaned up, see what it is. Be right back. This one turned out to be right before World War II, 1941, Washington nickel. On to the next beep. Well, in this hole, I already pulled out two memorial pennies, but I knew the signal was 45 to 50, so it wouldn't be that. It ended up being ribbon dental cream. Colgate Palmolive slash Peat Company, Jersey City, New Jersey. Kind of neat relic. On to the next beep. Out of this hole, I think I found another wheat scent. I will get it cleaned up. Be right back. It ended up being a 1945D wheat scent. On to the next beep. Well, it seems to be wheat scents day in this yard today. Pretty sure that's a wheat scent. We'll get her cleaned up. Be right back. It is a 1956, I believe it's a D, but it could be an S. I'll get her cleaned up when I get home. On to the next beep.
in this haul, I think I'm back on the Tootsie Toys. I'll get her cleaned up a little bit. Be right back. Yes, I do believe it's Tootsie Toy. I think we got a tow truck this time. I love digging these. On to the next beep. in this hole. I think I might have got me a Tootsie. We'll get her cleaned up and see what she looks like. Be right back. Yes it is. Definitely a Tootsie toy. Saw the marking on the bottom. It's always fun finding those. On to the next beep. In this hole, I got a canning jar lid that had the porcelain intact. I collect these. I see a little writing on it, so I'm just going to clean it up quick, see if I can identify it. I'll be right back. Well, it says Genuine Boyd's Cap for Mason Jar. Pretty cool. They uh, originally put these milk glass porcelain liners in there so the food would not come into contact with the lid. Kind of interesting. On to the next beep. In this hole, I had a pretty solid 83 signal. Sounded really good. Figured it was a coin. Not the right size. I think it may be a token. I'll get her cleaned up. We'll be right back. It is a token. And on this side, it's pretty, uh, pretty cool. Says freedom, got an eagle, some stars. Very nice. But it is no cash value. So I'm thinking it's probably not that old. I, it could be from a uh, carnival. The only thing I really do like about it, it seems to have a a lot of copper in it. It came out of the ground We're in great shape. Cool. On to the next beep. I thought I'd show you the house that I'm detecting today. It originally was just this square structure. The homeowner said later on they added this other room here. But I believe it's late 1800s, early 1900s. There's no basement, just a little bit of a crawl space and one very small area you can go down into like a root cellar, I understand. So I'm in his small backyard here, and out of this hole, it looks like I have another kid's toy. I'm going to get her cleaned up, be right back. Well this little toy ended up being a uh, semi that you may have heard just drive by. Um, it is made in Hong Kong. On to the next beep. Well, this is a really pleasant surprise. I was probing around for my metal target. I was digging in the plug and I found a clay marble. 
I believe that's my first one ever. Pretty awesome. That was definitely the first time I was happy I went after a pull tab signal because I got the clay marble. On to the next beep. I had to go deep for this one, but I'm glad I did. I think I got my second Tootsie toy. I'm gonna get it cleaned up, be right back. Can't quite make it out on the bottom, but those tires and axles look to me like it's gonna be a Tootsie toy. So we'll get her cleaned up, get some better pictures. On to the next beep. I really have to go deep for these Tootsie Toys today. I think I got a Volkswagen. Got one of them earlier this summer. I'll clean it up a little bit, be right back. If I remember right, they call these Tootsie Toy midgets. They were late 60s to into the 70s. Awesome, quite the collection I have today. On to the next beep. I've got a mid 80s to high 80s signal here. Kind of warrants a live dig. Very crisp and clear. Let's see what we got. Well, looks to be just a clad quarter. I'm always curious on what the date is, if we're close. 1984. On to the next beat. Out of this hole, I got a little coin spill. Got a uh, mercury dime and a nickel and a piece of iron. But I'll get them cleaned up and we'll get some dates for you. Be right back. It ended up being 1939 nickel and a 1944 Merc. On to the next beep. This signal is a solid 8081. Let's see what it is. Clad dime. On to the next beep. In this hole, looks like I found a little bling today. I can already see there's a lot of stones missing, but we'll get her cleaned up, see what she looks like. Be right back. 
Yep, she's got 90% of the bling missing. But kind of neat little bracelet. On to the next peep. That is definitely some of the biggest horse tack I've ever found. Pretty cool. On to the next peep. In this hole, I found the remnants of a old cap gun. I'll get it cleaned up a little bit, see if I can find a manufacturer on it. Be right back. In the field here, I could not find a manufacturer's mark. On to the next beep. In this hole, I found me a toy tractor. Looks like a red one. I'll get it uh, cleaned up a little bit. Be right back. I've been checking for the rear wheels. Haven't found them yet in the hole, but I'm gonna keep looking. That's the best I can get her cleaned up out in the field. On to the next beep.